May the 11th, 2017. The sun is shining on Ontario. It is beautiful out. It's a good day to be alive. <sighs> Headed to the T dot. I gotta go visit my mother. I need her help with something. Can't really discuss it with you guys, but I gotta go there. My mom and I have some paperwork to do because she's super smart and works in an office. And if I fill it out, it'll be wrong. So we're headed to see mom. She, and then maybe we'll go to the fishing store. I don't know. It's gonna be a long morning. I can't film very much of it. They won't let me film in her off. We'll bring something good to you. Don't worry. All right, we made it to Toronto. The local 30 offices, Sheet Metal Union. We're gonna run in here, they, I can't take my camera. We're gonna run in, get the paperwork I need filled out, filled out, and run back. And then I don't know what we're gonna do with the rest of the day, but it'll be exciting. Stay tuned, stay with me. All right, we're back, got all that done. Took a little longer than expected, but at least it's over. Now, since we're in the, the T-Dot, let's go check out the fishing store. It's always fun. Walleye opener coming up this weekend. Pro Jays coming at you. I don't get to come here very often because it's in the city, but I'm here today. What's up? What's up? What's going on at the Pro Jay today? Busy. Gonna be super busy today. Super busy? You guys look super busy. <laughs> We're in the heart of the city now, buying fishing gear. Store is loaded with stuff. I need some walleye bait to the weekend. What, Daiwa, Gary Yamamoto? I didn't see that coming. If there's anything you ever need and that's hard to find for bass fishing, Pro Jays Tackle is where to come. Look at it, it's full of stuff you can't normally find. They have everything here. I need to make some good choices for walleye fishing. Look at all the stuff. And you guys have more baits than anywhere else. More stuff I've never seen before in my life. Who's that? What's the secret weapon for walleye this weekend? Loaded. I spend all day here. I'm out of Pro Jays. They always hook you up. If you're looking for hard to find stuff, this is the place to come. Thank you. Hey, anytime, brother. Nice Stay out of trouble. All right, we're back on the road. Picked up some odds and ends stuff for walleye opener. It's pretty quiet in there today. They were telling me that all the lads are gone fishing. They're up crappy fishing. If you ever need hard to find stuff, and you're in the GTA, Pro Jays on, it's in like the Warden Shepherd Avenue area. Stop in, they have everything you need, fully stocked with everything, Daiwa gear, baits, tackle, line, especially hard to find stuff. And find my friend Jasper in there, and, you, and he doesn't have it, I'm sure he can track it down for you. Okay, here we go. I was just pulling out of the Pro Jays parking lot, and I met my buddy here, Mike. Huge follower of the show. Mike, say hi. Hi. You want to shout out to anybody, wife and kids? Uh, wife, kids, all my fishing buddies. A pleasure. What a great day to meet uh, here fishing today. Thank you so much, man. We're holding up traffic, but, you know, <laughs> thanks so much for stopping and talking, dude. Love it. Love it. All right, we made it to the Best Buy. I gotta go in there and check out some camera equipment for the vlog. Fishing's coming, we gotta get ready to film that. Mike, thanks so much for stopping to talk to me. If any of you guys see me anywhere, stop and talk vision. I, I'm more than happy you see me eating dinner at the fishing store anywhere. Stop, talk. Mike, thanks so much for making my day. All right, we made it home from the T-Dot. This vlog is incredibly late. It didn't share from Final Cut to the interwebs, the YouTube. So Amber had to restart it and now I gotta get it online. For the, you guys can watch it, it's go time. <sighs> Updated, struggle is real. Really sorry about that, folks. Try to get them up in the morning. This one, one o'clock, kind of slacking today. A couple hours till we go for turkeys. I hope it rains and then those people will stop building that house and then turkeys will come into range. Okay, I got home, I've been hanging out, waiting to go turkey hunting. There was a bunch of stuff that I was supposed to do, but I got caught up on the Bass Masters. I flipped on the TV, put the YouTube on, the Bass Masters was there, and I've now watched three tournaments in a row. This is why I try. I I love Bass Live, but I, I try not to watch it because I just get so hooked on watching it and I don't do anything else. So I got about 45 minutes before we got to leave for turkeys. Probably gonna watch the end of this event. You heard it, Jordan Lee, making moves. All right, we're walking in, taking a single hand. Renner, this is on you. This was your suggestion. Hopefully it comes through. 
His tips have helped me in the last couple weeks get turkeys closer and closer. So beautiful evening. Last night I was so cold sitting in there with the wind. Tonight it is warm, probably a little overdressed. I'd rather lay her down, sit around, and freeze my butt off like last night. All right, it's been kind of a slow night. I forgot my mask in the truck. I don't know if you can see, but there is a hen right there. Walking, walking up on us. There's a bunch of toms way down in the field, so hopefully they see her and they make their move. The she, the bad part in all this, I forgot my mask in the truck. We'll see if she notices. With the hip hop shit, physically and lyrically, I tend to do pop shit. But part of me miss if stardom be the part of the twist. They started in this, similar to gargling piss, quite nasty. Cruising in the whip in the V, it's like taffy. Assuming and presuming it's me, you like daffy. Duck down, hitting the ground. My style has gotta be some nature's how we sit in your town. Sooner than later, productive. I'm assuming you hate us. I'm perfect. Well, that was kind of a dull evening. Very much action at all. They're all hung up there, 150 yards away, looking for. They're all strutting out of that flock of hens. Anybody knows anything about turkey hunting? How come those uh, two toms are letting those three or four jakes hang out with those flock of hens while they should be breeding? Throw it in the comments below. Maybe you can help me out. I, packing out of here, it seems like it. every day we hunt, I end up bringing more and more gear. Struggle's real. Beautiful night out, but man, I wish I hadn't that shot at the turkey again. I want to get one so bad. All right, guys, just got home. Brought the puppies out the backyard. I need to cut the grass. Man, this terrible time of year. Hello, big bales. So we're home. Dog are playing out the backyard, having a big stretch, a big run. Bailey's having fun anyway. Montana is paying no attention to me. Bailey, Tana. Anyway, the puppies are having fun. Montana's running around. Bailey's in the background and Chili is somewhere. A little Chili. Turkey hunting was tough again tonight. Those gobblers are so hung up on those hens. I don't even know what to do other than keep going, keep calling, keep trying to get them in. Walleye opens in tomorrow is Friday. Walleye opens Saturday. Probably hit the walleye opener. Rice Lake is extremely flooded. The water is crazy high, so I don't know how that's going to go. I picked up some new baits to try on the weekend. And hopefully walleye opener smasher. It's been a tough spring for everything. Drove by the river tonight. Didn't see any steelhead. Looks like they're far gone. But guys, there she is right there. Guys, thanks so much for joining me again. Share with your friends. Let everybody know about the Fear Fishing Vlog webcast. Right, Tana? Everything else we do, get the word around, get it bigger, and we can bring you more stuff home for you guys to watch. Hope you're having a blast of a day, and we'll see you tomorrow.